In this video, we will give a quick overview of the Tendon Placement Automated Python part, or app as we like to call them. The Tendon Placement app includes everything necessary to create and place your post-tension tendons and connections at the ends through inputs in the palette. To begin, we will go to the palette and choose the library tab. The Tendon Placement app can be found in the default Python parts post-tensioning folder. Double left click to select the tendon placement. You can see the app tools open in the palette. This is where we can define the specifics of the tendon. First we will look at the first tab labeled placement. Here you can define the points and length of the tendon by selecting enter and clicking the start point, any intermediate points, and lastly the end point. You can then modify the elevation from bottom of slab and elongations for each point. You can then define the strand specifics such as steel grade and diameter. In the next tab, we can add the end connections on the tendon from the drop downs that reference our fixture library. Any fixture you create will show up in the drop down. In the next tab, you can add any attributes you would like to be tied to the tendon, such as designations, and color codes. When you are done, you can hit Escape to complete the part. Once you place your app in the model, you can simply double-click to get back into the properties and make any necessary changes. If for some reason you need to make any manual changes to your tendon, you can always get your part as close to what you need and turn it into a 3D element by unchecking the Create Python Part checkbox in the main page. After that, you can make any necessary adjustments needed. Have fun creating your tendon using the intuitive tendon placement app.